that is the amazing numbers he's been able to put up in his rookie season. Obviously, the opposing average of 204. And the strikeouts to walks just immediately stand out, and this gravity, they can get the barrels down there. Strikes them out. There's the circle change up. First strikeout for Skeens. I mean, he just picked them apart. Never threw him a strike, really. And look at the bottom drop out of that pitch. Ellie Dela Cruz doing everything he can to keep his hands working through the middle of the on the changeup. It's just weapons. <laughs> Comes back with a splinker, struck him out. Wow. Back to back strikeouts for Skeens. At 95. I mean, that pitch is in the middle of the plate. Almost three quarters of the way there. And then watch this bottom out. I mean, <laughs> what do you do with that? Just hope you can foul it off and live to play another day, but it's just electric stuff. It goes back to a changeup down and in. Skeen strikes out three in the first inning, and the Pirates have the lead. Tony about it, put on. It just takes care of Espinal. Four strikeouts through two innings for Paul Skeens. Pirates leading one to nothing. You know, try to find some of those answers, or at least uh, what would you think you can pencil in going into spring training. There's another strikeout for Paul Skeens. He has fanned five through three here in Cincinnati. Great teammate and an electric fastball. There it is. Six strikeouts for Skeens. That's just not fair. Yeah, that's a good, a good fastball. Look at that, 100 miles per hour. And that's the one that just picks apart the corners. One, two, three strikes you're out at the old ball game. Wow. Another changeup that just really runs. I mean, it's just a unique pitch, and I don't think he threw a ton of those the last couple starts against these Reds. So they're seeing something that the right on right changeup that. Again, he's bringing another pitch into his arsenal. And there's a good look from the HN Super Mode camera. Now. Another strikeout for Paul Skeens. Three more in the inning. Skeens with eight strikeouts through four. That he had prior to this earlier in the season. Now to Nick Gonzalez on the move. He got him. Yeah, nice play. Nick Gonzalez playing up the middle right there with the left hand hitting Jake Fraley. Had to range to his right and make that the throw off balance. And again, see where he's playing? A little chopper right there, you know, from the left side, Fraley's going to get down the line. But Nick Gonzalez has plenty of arm to make sure he throws right on the money. Now Espinal, one of Skeens' eight strikeouts. Hot shot to Triolo. Couple of outs. Some good plays on the left side of the diamond. So often we talk about why it's hard to play in the big leagues and why it's hard to hit in the big leagues. This is why right here. Even when you barrel up a ball against a tough pitcher, room service. Here Triolo just pops right back up. Throw is right on the money, plenty of time. Two nothing feels like an insurmountable deficit for the Reds with schemes on the mound. And when you think about the potential for the postseason, that's the guy you want to have, a guy like that. Nine strikeouts for Paul Skeens. Pirates leading two to nothing. 